Welcome back to Hurley's Hobbies. Well, I got the door hinge. I got my little hinges, my little door handles made. I got my uh, door latches in. And I'm going to bring you in a little closer and show you how I did it. I did take the hinges. These hinges came with the kit. They're made for the door in the upper window. And I cut them down and nip off the corners so they don't protrude out the back side um, these little when you buy these latches I got them off Amazon they just have a rod sticking out and I cut the rod down and then I took just took a quarter inch piece of uh, I think this is actually maple or the, the hardwood one and I make I sand them and make them to make them look like door handles and I didn't video the hinges you need to set this door you make your figure out where you want mark it put your put the hinges in you know cut your slots put the hinges in and I opened the slots up a little bit more with this little bit wider blade than the standard blade but I start with this one I'm going to show you how I do it on this top when I put this top one in and you have to adjust the door, maneuver it, and get it where you want it before you glue it. But I think this these little handles look a little better. They actually cover the, the slots from these. And I think it looks a lot better. I did cut the top of these off a little bit before I glued them on. Um, the top door... I did glue these windows in. Um, I have this uh, micro crystal clear, but I did not use this. I actually very carefully just took medium CA and went around the back side lightly and glued them in, and they are in there nice and strong. I was worried about this coming loose. Um, it's okay for like my semi and stuff like that, but with the wind. The high winds I didn't want to chance it like I say I just I don't use any accelerator I just take the medium CA and lightly wick it in around it and so you didn't you don't discolor the, the plastic um, I'm probably gonna put my servos in put my fuel tank all my electronics in here and get the pole pole run and get that done before I put this on because they make it more difficult I did get all the other windows made, except for I have not cut this front window, and I have not made this window yet. Um, but all the rest of them were made in the same way. And they actually, I did it, like, I, I get like 10 minutes right after I got home from work or something before dinner was ready, and I would work on it. And it just took me a little, a few weeks to get that done. And so next... I'll be putting all the servos in, cutting the servos out back there, cutting my slots, put my control surfaces, rods on. So that'll be the next thing. So hopefully you like what you're seeing. Please like, subscribe, and comment. And we'll see you on the next one.